I believe you can change the circumstances if you believe that they are worth changing. It starts with writing down your goals. That's what worked for me. Today, I'm keeping it very simple with the Lipton. What's up, you guys? Welcome to the first episode of Talks with Ness. Today, I wanted to talk to you about your goals. And if you don't have any goals, hopefully by me going over some of my goals in depth, it'll help you create some goals for yourself because they're very important. The concept of this video came about from me uh, cutting one of my clients. And um, the quote that I actually uh, said in the beginning of the video is something I said to him. And um, you know what I'm saying? I just wanted to elaborate on it. And you know, I always end up getting into some conversation about uh, goals and just stuff people are trying to achieve. And I ask people like, did you write that stuff down? Or are you writing this stuff down? And then they'll say no. And then I'm like, well, you wanna read my goals? And then from there, they go ahead and read my goals. And then they're like, yo, these are some really good goals. I should, you know, start doing this. So that's how this video came about. And um, let's talk about it. So I actually have a lot of goals. So, you know what I mean? I'm gonna try to get through all of these. I think there's like 25 or 26 goals here. So I'm just gonna read them off and elaborate on them a little bit. So now would be a good time to get a pen if you don't have it, because I feel like some of this stuff is going to help some of you guys out. Tune in, tap in, let's get it. So my first goal for 2021, by the way, I just turned 29. So uh, these goals are very like adult based, if you want to say, you know what I'm saying? So my first goal for 2021 is pay off all my debt. I'm happy to report that I've actually done that. I paid off all my debt. I don't owe anybody a thing. But the reason why this is so important and very detrimental to your success is just because like, you don't want to feel like there's somebody always in your pocket. Like when you're trying to do something or bust a move, make a move, whatever you're trying to do, um, when you're trying to elevate or push yourself forward, you don't want to always feel like somebody's in your pocket. So I highly recommend that you guys start thinking about paying off your debt and formulate a plan and or strategy to do that. And if you need one, let me know, comment below. I'll make a video on how my strategy that I use to pay off my debt. Uh, let's all be debt free for 20, 20. 21 you know what i'm saying so the next thing on my list for 2021 is revamp all of my brands so i feel like every year if you're running any type of business so if you're running any type of brands if you are a brand owner or if you are the brand i feel like you should be revamping yourself every year so every year that is on my goal list to revamp my brand um just do something different this year just make it more fresh uh make it more i don't want to say hip but just make it more you know of a thing so um, yeah, revamping your brand is very important. You always want to come with new, fresh ideas, new, fresh, you know, looks, vibes, whatever it is for your brand so that way it can thrive. So that is on my goals for 2021. And I'm proud to report that um, I'm almost done with that. I'm actually in the process of doing that now, like, you know, teamed up with some good people. So, yes, sir. The next thing on my list is move out of New Jersey. Moving out of where you live in general is so important period. You get what I'm saying? I'm actually working on moving out of New Jersey right now. Uh, the two places on my list right now of moving is either California or Atlanta. Um, both of those places, I feel like I would thrive to, to the, to the, like, you know what I'm saying? I feel like moving out of where you live is very important uh, for your success because sometimes where you live, you're limited. And sometimes where you live, people will look at you or view anything that they won't value what you do as much because that's where you're from. Do it do it go hard wherever you decide to go and really spread your wings and try to grow you know what i'm saying or not try to grow but grow uh strive to be better so yeah next thing on my list is shoot with more companies and brands because as you know i am a photographer you know what i'm saying but i do want to just shoot with more companies and brands because not only do they pay more but i just like more reliable business i know certain things are going to be taken care of i know that i'm going to be treated as a professional at all times i know my clients are going to be um, you know they're going to uh, appreciate me treating them the way i need to treat them and they're going to appreciate my poise and my professionalism so i just want to shoot with more companies and brands because like i said not only is the money there but it's just more it's just it's just better it just it just works out better so that's one of my goals i am doing that right now whether it be on instagram TikTok, uh youtube whatever it is uh that's one of the things that i'm doing as well so i want to shoot more companies and brands change my phone number is the next one change my phone number uh that is important to me i have yet to do that change your phone number is important i haven't done that yet but i'm gonna get there cut off all dead ends was the next thing on my list for 2021 the reason i feel like i need to cut off all de dead ends is the same reason i mentioned um you know with changing my phone number uh, when you're trying to elevate and you're trying to go somewhere and you're trying to see yourself be better or be that better person, cut that shit off so you keep pushing. You know what I'm saying? But that was on my goal list. Hopefully you guys can take that and use it for yourselves too. Next thing on my list for 2021, keep myself in the best shape all year round. Now that is something that I've been very focused on doing. I'm actually in better shape now than I was when I was in the military uh, like seven years ago. Keep yourself in the best shape all year round. You know what I'm saying don't play with yourself. Don't slack on yourself. 
uh, take yourself seriously and get it done. You know I mean, so commit to yourself, man. Commit to yourself. It'll always like pay off in the long run, especially with your goals. The next thing on my goal list for 2021 is to settle down. At this point in life, at 29, you know I mean, I'd rather just, you know, have one partner that I'm building a foundation with. You have to put stuff like this on your goal list. Settling down doesn't necessarily have to mean that you have to get married and all that other shit. Settling down just means that you're gonna sit your ass down. You know what I'm saying? You ain't out here trying to talk to her, 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 her. And on female end, him, 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 him. You know what I'm saying? You sitting your ass down. So settling down is on my list for 2021. Hopefully, you know, you guys feel the same and hopefully you guys sit your ass down. That's that. So the next thing on my list for 2021 is to surround myself with those that will genuinely love and support me. I just want to surround myself with more people that actually support what I'm doing and what I'm going for. People that openly support me and that show that like they really want to see me win. I feel like that that's what we all need to do. Surround ourselves with the best uh, team or group of people that will um, inspire us, enlighten us, and take us to take us to newer heights. Um, not even not even just financially, but um, just mentally as well. So that's one of my goals for 2021. So I hope you guys like you know can take that and do that. Do what you will with it. So yeah. The next thing on my list is no more discounts. That is such a big thing for me for 2021. No more discounts because I feel like I've missed out on so much money and just so much uh, like gain in terms of like just being able to invest more into myself and my businesses because I've, I've given out so many discounts. When I charge a premium or when I know how much work is gonna be done and I constantly discount, I'm like putting myself behind on my goal. You need to be getting your bread to do what you gotta do. I need to be getting my bread to do what I gotta do. So one of my goals for 2021 is to definitely stay away from doing more discounts and charge what I feel like I'm worth and make sure I get that in full. I encourage you guys to do the same. No more discounts for 2020. 21. That's it. So the next thing on my list is focus on one thing. But I'm an Aquarius. I'm a creative. Focusing on one thing for me is is is, is very important this year. Um, just to see myself grow in one area more, so that way I can contribute to another area fully. Sometimes doing multiple things and spreading yourselves out so thin um, can stunt your growth or can slow down your growth. So for this year, focusing on one thing is definitely like key for me if you feel like you're doing one thing and it's not giving you or it's not fulfilling you uh the way you need to be fulfilled you need to peel off and do what you know what i'm saying go to something else so that way you can focus on the next thing don't keep don't have a bunch of projects because i've done that too many times and um i do feel like it slowed me down in ways focus on one thing that's my goal hopefully you use that for yourselves so the next thing on my list for 2021 is to organize myself for a more successful year. Yo, let me tell you, staying organized is so important and so crucial uh, when you're trying to build yourself up and take yourself to the next level. You need to be organized. You need to know what is what. You know what I mean? Like in the army, uh, we used to take you know accountability for everything that we had or everything that we had to do. If if our hands didn't touch it, it wasn't it wasn't green. It couldn't. It wasn't a go. So put organizing yourself on like top priority every single day. You need to know what you're doing. You need to know where you're going and stick to that. You know what I'm saying? Organizing yourself for a more successful year at the beginning of the year. Right now, your goals. Right now, what you want to do. Right now, where you want to go. Everything. It's it's very important when you're trying to be successful. So that is what's on my goal list for 2021. That's on my goal list every year is to organize myself for a more successful year every single year in every single way throwing out old shit people very important you feel me so organize yourself for a more successful year that's on my list use that how you man yes sir the next thing on my list is to get rich i used to have a number a dollar amount now i don't have a dollar amount for those that know me and those that don't know uh, my mom passed away on sunday january 3rd 2021 it was probably the hardest thing that i've ever gone through and i told my mom before she passed uh, psh, i'm gonna get rich this year and i'm gonna take care of you. i'm gonna do what i need to do to make sure that you're okay and i promise you that and my mother believed in me like she really believed it, like that i could do it so that was on my list like this was my list before she passed this was my list before the ball drop i am gonna get rich this year i believe it i feel it and I have a star next to it actually i don't know if you can see that so yeah that's gonna happen the next thing on my list is to llc all of my businesses all of my businesses are not llc i have a bunch of different you know career paths and companies that i you know work on and things that i do and i need to llc them because i didn't realize that as an entrepreneur uh you're spending a lot of money when your businesses aren't llc'd or they're not like on the books, you feel what I'm saying? You're wasting a lot of money because you can't write off a lot of things. So LLCM for me has been very important this year. Um, so yeah, I had to put that on my goal list, LLC, all of my businesses, 
I highly encourage anybody that has a business or you're just starting. As soon as you start investing in, you know, bigger equipment and you start, you start seeing yourself scale, go ahead and LLC your business. So that way, uh, when you're buying these things and investing in your business, you can write these things off in your taxes. It'll just help you in the long run. That's a whole nother video that I'm going to work on, but this is what Talks, is, uh, Talks with Ness is about. So yeah. LLC, all of my businesses for 2021. You should do the same. Um, next on my list is spend more time with my mom. Like I said, my mom passed Sunday, January 3rd, 2021. Um, I did that. You know what I'm saying? I spent, as, I spent as much time as I could with my mom. I did everything that I was supposed to do. I uh, definitely spent a lot of time with my mom. I appreciated every every second I got with my mom. To anybody out there, you should make that, put that on your goal list to spend more time with your loved ones. It's very important. You know what I'm saying? Very important. Um, on, on, on a lot of different levels, not only just for you and your mental, but um, for their mental as well, because you don't realize how much uh, we all suffer from something um, internal. We all suffer from some type of trauma and sometimes spending more time with our loved ones, spending more time and getting to know who our loved ones are uh, helps them and us through it. So spending more time with my mom was definitely an important thing for me. And I just encourage everybody else to spend more time with your loved ones in general. You know what I'm saying? It'll, it'll, it'll make a lot of difference. So goals, man, goals. Uh, the next thing on my list is live more simplistic. I own a lot of equipment. I owned a, I own a lot of clothes and stuff like that. So I've been just like selling things for like way less than it's actually worth. I've I, like, if I paid a thousand or 400 for something you're probably only going to pay like 150 200 like i've been selling a lot of stuff because i just realized i don't need all of the stuff that i have um a lot of things i bought at different times i was uh i don't want to say i was different people but i wore different hats so i've accumulated a lot of things over the years to live more simplistically is to free up your mind of just extra clutter and things that you don't need so live more simplistic go forward not backward get rid of the clutter out of your life that you do not need a lot of these things are like they just work with each other a lot of things that i'm saying just piggyback off of each other a lot so pay attention live simplistic so the next goal on my list for 2021 is to listen more to understand i feel like a lot of times we speak or we do things without fully understanding the situation the whys and all that other stuff me being where i am in life uh career wise and financially and just like just doing bigger things all came from me just listening to the right people and the wrong people when i say listen to the wrong people just listen about what not to do because listening will take you everywhere in life you know what i'm saying sometimes you just gotta listen so yeah listen more to understand the next thing on my 2021 goals is to become a life coach i feel like i've been a life coach i'm not gonna lie like i feel like i've always had an old soul and i've always been given out game in, like in life and i've always been able to receive games so well um i've always been a life coach but now i plan on getting certified for it this year and um you know really just helping people understand themselves in situations and so on and so forth and just helping people like you know with their guidance through my divine guidance you know what i'm saying so um that's one of the things i'm working on for this year so becoming a life coach let's say you want to do something this year you want to become something really put your mind forward and you know put your money where your mouth is and really invest in that and do that because that's what you said you wanted to do for you so why wouldn't you cash that out look at me life coaching already right you know what i'm saying shout out to me it's giddy so the next thing on my list for 2021 is to love the woman that loves me wholeheartedly now this goes back to like you know personal things that me and my mom talked about the next thing on my list is to spend more time learning and traveling traveling in general like getting out of where you're from just going out to do going getting out of the house and going to do more like worldly things or earthly things you don't necessarily have to go to the other side of the map um, but you do need to get out and explore the world uh, go see nature that's what I want to do I just want to go see nature I just want to go experience certain things take in certain um, breaths of air, see certain sights. So yeah, just spend more time learning and traveling, not only about myself, but just the world in general and just seeing what the world has to offer me and what I have to give back to the world. So yes, sir. The next thing on my list is make solid and meaningful connections. Meaning I'm not trying to just have you around me just to have you around me. If you're around me, you're somebody that I confide in, you're somebody that I could trust, you're somebody that I love. And it goes for friends, family, loved ones, whatever. You feel me? Just make more meaningful connections. Invest in the people that believe in me and, and vice versa. Make more meaningful connections for me. It's very important. I hope that, you know what I'm saying, you guys can take, take from that what you will. We got three more to go and that's it, I'm done. The next thing is make more meaningful content. Similar to this, um, not just making videos, just to throw videos up not just taking pictures to take pictures um really taking the time to invest in the content and 
not only just money wise but just like what it means like what it'll do for somebody how to help somebody so hopefully this video as long as it is hopefully it will help somebody and i encourage you to do the same so the next thing on my list is to shoot way more pictures and video this for me just means like you know documenting more things in my life a lot of memories and just creating more memories for myself uh growing up i feel like i didn't i didn't really i don't really have too many videos and pictures of myself from when i was younger i had pictures of when i was a baby but it was like a gap in between where i feel like i don't even remember like what I really like look like. For me, just shooting more uh, pictures and video, which is why I kind of like invested in this new camera here to get more, you know what I mean? Get more, you know, memories and stuff like that is just important. You know what I'm saying? Having some type of history to recall or some type of memories to recall back to a past, whether it was good or bad, is always, um, you know, a good thing. So. I just want to embrace that more so and i'm a photographer and a videographer so so why not so i encourage you guys to do the same thing i mean uh take more pictures and video because you'll appreciate yourself later for it and the last thing on my list the last thing which was probably it probably should have been like further up on my list but the last thing on my list is to save money 100k i only had debt from just investing in my businesses and equipment and so on and so forth um but now that I'm just debt free, it's like now I could really save. So I'm trying to save 100K this year. Not even trying, I am gonna save 100K this year. So those were my 2021 goals. You know what I'm saying? I hope that did something for you. I hope you guys took something from it. This has been Talks with Ness. If you guys enjoyed this, let me know. I know this has been an extensive video, but I know this will help somebody somewhere. So I just really wanted to, you know what I'm saying, dig deep, show you guys what I think of on a daily what I'm constantly going through and what I'm constantly like trying to you know be better at so that's about it that's my rant <laughs> that's my goal list and I hope you guys enjoy it peace make sure you comment like subscribe and hit that notification bell to be part of the notification squad and that's about it Ness out peace